and then we go back to our navigation and if we go back again we go back to our navigation menu which is a bit odd it's a bit weird is it a bug <laughs> So I have a simple site set up here with a single navigation block placed in my header, in my sidebar and in my footer and it's the same navigation block. Now there are two ways we can make changes to this navigation block but first we need to go to our site editor. Now in my template I'm going to select the menu and as this is the same navigation block if I go to my settings and drag and drop any of these menu items. Now wherever those navigation blocks have been placed in my template any menu changes I make will be reflected in those navigation blocks. Now there is another way to edit menus. If I select the menu and click edit, we go into what's known as the focus view. Now any changes I make here again will be reflected in the navigation block wherever it's used in my template. And this is where it goes a little bit strange. Now if we go back to our site editor side menu, and then we go back to our navigation, and if we go back again, we go back to our navigation menu, which is a bit odd, it's a bit weird. Is it a bug? It may get fixed in future releases, but in my opinion, this is confusing. So how can we fix this? Well, the way to fix this is to rename this menu from navigation to something other than navigation, which is in our navigation menu from our site editor menu, which if you're not confused by now, then you should be. Inevitably, we will rename this, but to illustrate the current issue and to show you how to create new menus, I'm going to duplicate this menu first. So from my action menu, I'm going to select duplicate and then I'm going to rename this menu to second menu because it's going to be my second menu. If I can spell it. Okay, so now I have two menus and I go back to my navigation menu. You'll see that we no longer have a list of menu items, but a list of menus. But we still have this issue of having a navigation menu in the navigation menu weird so all we need to do is to just rename this menu to something more sensible like main menu and that should alleviate any confusion because now in your navigation menu you have two menus one called second menu and another called main menu and now we can make changes to our menus by entering our focus mode and we can go to the settings and make changes and these changes will be reflective wherever this navigation block is used in our templates so I'm just going to go back to my second menu I'm going to make some obvious changes because I want it to be obvious where this appears in my template and now going back to my template I can select the navigation block in my sidebar and go to my settings and go to my menu options and I'm going to change this from the main menu to the second menu that we just created as you can see, these are reflective of the changes we made through the site editor navigation menu. And we can also add menus from within our templates. All we need to do is to select a navigation block in our template, go to our settings, and then go to the menu options, and under the tool section, use the create menu. And this will just create an empty menu. Um, with There are no items, so I just need to add in some custom links, and I can add in my... Twitter or X or whatever it's called these days. I'm going to add Instagram. And you can also change the labels from within your template as well. And there you have it. And hopefully that will help you avoid that common issue you might get with the navigation block. So if you've liked this video, please do get a thumbs up. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comments. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.